Before you begin, make sure you have a scope plugged into the Arietta 850. If the new patient screen appears, press Start before selecting the Review button. Otherwise, press the Review button on the main console. Once the Review button is selected, the scope can be disconnected if desired. Once on the review screen, you can search for an exam by selecting Find on the touch panel. Enter the patient's ID number, name, or study date. Then use the trackball to move the cursor over the search button and hit the Enter key. If you are going to save images or videos from a current patient and case that was just completed, you will not have to search. The images and videos will appear automatically on the review screen. After you select the desired exam, all the images and videos for that exam will appear. You may select any image at this time by using the trackball and moving the cursor over the image and hitting the Enter key. Or you can select all by hitting the button on the touch panel. Once you are ready to transfer the images to a USB, plug the USB into the USB port. On the touch panel, select USB PC format. The system will ask you if you are sure you want to save these images. Select OK. At the bottom of the ultrasound monitor, look for a bar that tracks the progress of the transfer. It will notify you when the transfer is complete. Once complete, you can remove the USB. Tip. You can make any file a teaching file. This means that the patient information is masked on the file that is saved to the USB. To do this, simply click Archive Setup on the main monitor. A pop-up box will appear. You can choose what items you would like to mask and then turn this feature on for PC format. Select Exit at the bottom of the pop-up box. Then continue saving as usual. Select USB PC format on the touch screen and choose OK when the pop-up box appears. Then select Exit when the archive box appears, notifying you it is a teaching file. Your images will then be saved to the USB as teaching files.